Today, it's no surprise when Emma Watson expresses her flair for fashion at movie premieres and award shows, but back in 2001, the then 11-year-old was practicing her wizardry skills alongside Daniel Radcliffe and Rupert Grint in the Harry Potter series. As a young actress growing up in the spotlight, her beauty evolution was just getting started. We all got to know her as this really sweet, kind of geeky Hermione, and then she started walking on the carpets and she was this gorgeous, adorable little thing. She really looked like she was having a great time playing dress up. I know, I'm so lucky. As Watson reached her early teens, her style began to truly blossom. In 2004, she polished her look when she arrived at the New York premiere of Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. I think Emma Watson's makeup during her early years was just very natural, very fresh face, very age appropriate. And in 2007, she lightened her hair by getting blonde highlights. She lined her hair and she's becoming a little bit more glamorous. She did it so sophisticatedly and it just really added some dimension to her beautiful locks. And in 2009, Watson made a name for herself when she became the face of Burberry. I think she's starting to play with fashion. I mean, she's done a Burberry ad. She's involved in fashion. I think fashion has embraced her because of how great she looks. In 2010, Emma redefined her look and debuted her pixie cut at the New York Deathly Hallows premiere, sporting a sleek black dress by Calvin Klein. She has a cute little face, and I love that she just framed her face with this very short haircut, and it made her even more beautiful and actually gave her a certain maturity. She's got the most beautiful face, such fine features, and that pixie really brings out her gorgeous eyes, high cheekbones, pretty lips. She became more fashionable and we started to notice her makeup more too. Cosmetic lines took notice and in 2011, Emma was named the new face of Lancome. But Emma's fashion didn't take a back seat. At the 2014 Golden Globe Awards, Emma posed in a vibrant red Christian Dior design. Emma Watson's hair on the red carpet is chic, but it's flirty and she always can just pull off anything. She's got a very simple style, it's very clean and it's very classic, but there's always something a little edgy about it. From her early beginnings as a child actor in the Harry Potter series to the trend-setting actress we see today, Emma Watson reminds us that beauty is always an evolution. This is Emma Watson, Beauty Evolution. For more Beauty Evolutions, subscribe to the Allure channel.